three years ago, a woman named Crystal Joseph decided to open a restaurant in the Strip District of Pittsburgh. Now, she'd never been in the restaurant business before, so she figured she'd just go with the home cooking she grew up with. And at Crystal, that means a little taste of the Middle East. Do I want the rice? Grape leaves and a lot of tabbouleh. Mm. I want some more of that. I love the combo. It's got kibbe and lamb and grape leaves. Authentic Lebanese cuisine. 63 grape leaves kibbe. From authentic Lebanese family recipes. My mother taught me how to make it. You got it ready? And with mom to rely on. Lamb sandwich set up, mom. Yep. When Crystal got a chance to open this joint, it just seemed to make sense. I had no clue where I was going, what I was going to do. 70, 71. I just had a really good feeling when I walked into this building. And now the feeling's alive. This feeling is definitely alive. Thank you. You're so welcome. And I've opened a lot of people's taste buds up to the Lebanese food. I was like, try something new, and I was like, all right, I like this. She said, here, try my lamb. I tried it one time. That's all I get now. Lamb on a rod. Tasty. It's fantastic. We're going to make lamb on the rod. Is that what it's called? Laha yes. Well, it's easy for you to say. Oh, yeah? So how do we make it? First, we take leg of lamb. Bone rolled and tied. And then we cube it up. How did you learn how to make this? I learned how to cube it from my father was a butcher. Can I help? Oh, I thought it was one of those trick ones like right? <laughs> I like to leave this on the counter and then run it through. I like to look like I'm dangerous. Because you're like, hey, what? what? I'm done with mine. <laughs> no, you're not. Look. Oh, you want it all the way? I was trying to give you a value conscious no, meal no, service. No, 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 no. That's half the lamp. Is that nice? Yep. I'm very That's not sort of thing. OK. Now we put them in here. We are going to marinate this in chopped green peppers. Onions. Onions, lemon juice. Next is oil. Chopped garlic. Now, how long do we want to let this marinate? Overnight. Overnight, fantastic. Turn the grill in. A little bit of oil. Nice squirt bottle thing. Have you ever seen guys big bite? Put our peppers and onions and okay. garlic in here. A little bit of butter. You put a little saute on those. When do these go on now? Yeah. Me so much done. That one must have been yours. This one back here? Yeah. The more premium looking one? <laughs> Show me the magic. I have a delicious garlic sauce. Is that normal in Lebanese food that you get this little accoutrement each time? Everything gets the peppers and the garlic. Looks great. My mouth's watering. Is it? I'll add some pita bread, a little bit of parsley flakes. I think it looks pretty. You get the sauce, throw a pepper. At least that skewer's not smoking hot. Wait, so you hold the end of the skewer with the bread. Ah! And then you remove it with the bread. Mm-hmm. That's great. Mmm. Excellent. Lamb's got great flavor. So is it okay to make little sandwiches out of it? Yes, little sandwiches with those little boshes. This is definitely a first on Triple D. Little boshes in Pittsburgh.